Miles, Jacob, you have a visitor. Call it the Olympus. That's the mountain where the Greek gods used to live. And what the fuck am I doing here? You're the key that'll unlock the door to a new era. Oh. How are you feeling? Tired. Try and get some rest. Today was just the beginning. You're doing great, Jacob. Just hold on a little longer. Please, no. Specimen Z is ready. Now we begin the apocalypse. Hello, my name is Abraham Valley. I've been fighting this virus for years now. I've lost many friends and family. But still, I fight for the survival of humanity. Because maybe, one day, everything can get back to normal. After a lot of research, I know that this virus wasn't created by nature, but by humans. Fast, come with me. Thank you. Stay here. Come on, let's go. What is your name? Roxanne. And yours? My name is Abraham. But what happened to you? Well, I was on vacation with friends, but we got ambushed by those creatures. I was the only one who survived. Okay. We better go to sleep now. Morning. Hi. I'm in position. No!
Everything is going as planned. We created the zombies. Why? Because they are the cure for the disease. We have spotted three survivors in a warehouse north. Bring them to me. Alive. Come on, get in. Look, a car. I'll hold them off. Shit, zombies. Well, we can't go back. I only got one of them. Where did the others go? They ran away. Well, get after them. You think we killed all of them? I think so. Over here! Who are you? My name is Abraham, but they have turned me into a monster. Who? Those people with black suits and skull masks. You have to help me. What do we have to do? There are other survivors around here. Find them and they will help you. Help you find the cure. The cure to end this apocalypse. I have one idea where it might be. The Riverside Army Base. Okay, do you want to come with us? No, I just need your gun. Uh, okay. What? No. No, what the... What are you doing here? And who are you? I am Charles, and my friend here is Bart. We need your help. To stop the apocalypse. Okay, we're in. What do we have to do? Abraham said it was here. Who is Abraham? Shh, be quiet. Huh. Come on, get in. Bart, you go for the cure. Please. Help me. Not so fast. Charles!
Come with me, fast! You can't run away from me! Surrender, Roxanne. Ah, you know my name. Well, I know you want a cure, but you'll never get it. And you won't be able to stop the apocalypse. See you. After hell. No! And? Did you find a cure? No. Where's Charles? Um... He's dead. No. No. Guys? We have a little problem. What is it? Zombies. You guys okay? I'm fine. <clears throat> We are out of ammo and food. What? How? Oh, no, I just wanted to eat something and um... Doesn't matter. We split up in teams and search for supplies. Philip, you go with them, uh... The name is Quentin. Oh, Philip, you go with Quentin. Alex, you go with Gregory. I'll stay here to hold the fort. Philip, can I tell you something? Yeah, sure. My real name isn't Quinton. It's Drake. I was a criminal. Are you afraid Bart will arrest you? Well, I was wanted in Astor. The police arrested me, but then those creatures attacked the car and I managed to escape. So, how was your life before the apocalypse? Different, I was a bounty hunter, just like my friend, James. But before that, he and I were soldiers in the National Army. Generals, to be exact. James said things about the president, that he was working for some kind of murder bot. We both got kicked out of the army. Later, we found out that that story about the president wasn't true. Did you hear that? Hear what? You're bit! No, I'm not! Yes, you are! Now, if you want to become a zombie, fine. But if you want to survive, then I have to cut your arm off. This might hurt a little. Wait! Please, let me come with you. We better get back to the base now. The sun is going down. Ah, we're finally back. Ugh. Yeah, it sure as hell ain't fun out there. You might be thinking, what am I doing here? Well, you are here for research. Oh wait, I forgot to introduce myself. I am John, and my code name is The Cannibal. Um, sir. Yes? That guy in that orange suit is infected. Take him then. What are you doing with him? How about...
about you just shut your mouth? How about that? What the hell? Wait, 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 wait. I'm totally not a bad person. I'm just different. Adios, amigos. What's going on? Who are you people? I want names. I am Bard Olson. I'm Philip Clarkson. I am Gregory Broskovich. I am Quinton. Last name? Uh, uh, Lagos. I am Alice Costell. Costell? Are you family of Desmond and Roxanne Costell? Yes. Your father is here. Hello, Alice. We have a lot to discuss. All of us. First of all, I am Desmond, the ex-president. Second, where's Roxanne's body? Roxanne is my daughter, and so is Alice. What? I know Roxanne is dead. You know what? I'll tell you a little something about her. She made the virus in order of the new president. The new president needed that virus because he thinks he can rebuild the world after destroying, or more like killing, all evil. That evil is us. Us and everyone who isn't the new president. Now, Roxanne was hired to create and release the virus. I heard that she had the cure. Cure? There is no cure for this virus. Are you alone here? Or do you have an entire army waiting outside? No, I came here with Eric and Nor, my two bravest soldiers. I do have a helicopter waiting outside, though. What? Uh, guys, we have a problem. That was all of them. Who the hell are you? Eric, calm down. You don't have to... I asked you a question. I am James Wolfe. James! Long time no seen. It's okay, it's okay. He's a friend of mine. Thanks, man. No problem. What's wrong? Nothing. Oh, come on. I know that look. What's wrong? It's just a friend of mine was taken, or actually abducted today. His name is Alex. I saved him his life once. I don't know where he is now. He could be dead. <clears throat> you remember the time when we were bounty hunters and I always used to track down the targets? I could do that for, um, Alex. Hello there. What is your name? Go to hell. Hmm, that's an interesting name. Yikes. Okay, let's make a deal. I give you food if you tell me your name. Sure, I'm Alex. Good boy. Here you have some food. <coughs> Sir, she is here. It's been a while. Yes, I know. How far are you with the serum? The serum is done. And that group of survivors you said was in the way? They will be taken care of them soon. Good. All right, get him out of the car. 
Please, don't do this. Tell me, Alex, why would we stop? I have useful information. I know the location. Hold up. I'll tell you when you let me go. Of course. Test the subjects on someone else. But sir, we don't have any other prisoners. I don't care. Use him. They're in the Riverside Army base. Good. Can I go now? Yeah, whatever. Thank you. Thank you so much. Damn. What the? You can come out now. I'll shoot him. All right, that's it. No! Get wrecked, mate. Take your best shot. What, what happened to you? You're welcome. Stay with me, man. You <coughs> have to shoot me. Please stay with me. There are too many of them. Get to the trucks back. Abraham, what happened to you? You should kill me. I am a monster. No. I can't do anything good. You're safe here. You're with us now. Did you find the cure? No, I didn't. So the cannibal is dead now? Yeah. I'm gonna go grab a cup of coffee. Does anyone else want some too? Yeah, I'd like some coffee. You didn't tell Bart, right? No, of course I didn't. Hi there. Hi. Nothing personal. He is dead. What should we do? Call the president and tell him I'm quitting. But ma'am. What about the virus? Let the virus do his job. After five months, you and your men go out there and clean everything up. Make sure the virus is under control by then, but for now, stay put. Hey, do we have a doctor or something? I can help.
What the hell, Gregory? What are you doing? I'm just doing what is right. I'm killing evil. So you just shoot people of our group? I only shot one person, a bad person. Do you even know he was a mob boss? His name isn't even Quentin. His real name is Drake. What are you talking about? But Drake wasn't my target. You were. Because you are a traitor. You are working for the new president who released this virus. What? I'm not working for the new president. I'm with the old president. We're on the same side. Liar. I have to get the bullet out. Here, use this. Thanks. It has been too long. I'm going after them. Be careful. I will. Nothing you can do. You're very unstable. Made a serious mistake because now I have to kill you. Take good care of the group. I'm sorry. Sir, we just got news that Roxanne quit. She just left. What? She's just leaving? But why? What about the virus? She can't just leave without ending it. We were so close. This can't be happening right now. Do you want us to track her down, sir? Yes, please. Here you go, Abraham. Did Bart tell you my name? Yeah. He's one of the good guys, you know. You shouldn't waste your food on me. I'm not one of the good guys. You are. And even if you weren't, you are now. How do you know? I can see it in your eyes. Before the apocalypse started, I was working in a garage. I had this beautiful blue car. I drove away with it into the wasteland. And then the apocalypse started. Worst move I ever made. All this, it's gonna end one day. And we'll both be around to see the new world. Just have a little faith in yourself. Hey. I have a question. Why do we fight if there's nothing to fight for? There's always something to fight for. Family, friends. No, I just want peace. Then that's your reason to fight. No, I'll never get over this madness. It will always haunt me. Yes, you're right about that. But our next generations, they deserve a better world. I just need, I your, just gun. need your gun. gun. Subject 2 is still alive after a gunshot in the head at close range. Now we can prepare them for the next stage. Fighting skills. Is he... dead? Yes. Why? I mean, he was a good person! And you also shot Quentin! Bart was a traitor. He was working for a group called the Phantoms. The same group 
where Roxanne was working for, the group that killed Alex. How are you so sure about that? I found a recording device. He was sending intel to the new president. Bart didn't kill Roxanne. He just let her kill herself. He used to be a cop, but later he was hired to do something else. So why was he out here, with our group when he was supposed to be inside the walls of Astor? That's right, he was supposed to kill us. Maybe he had a mission outside of Astor, but the virus got released so he couldn't get back. Real cops don't have missions outside of Astor. Why did you shoot Quentin? Drake? Oops, I mean, Quentin was a mob boss. He gave me and James a mission that almost got us killed. He was also the one who ate all our food. But I mainly shot him to lure Bart out. Zombies incoming. Hundreds of them. Ah, oh, shit. Now what do we do? What about the helicopter? It's out of fuel. Crap. We can blow it up. We still have some explosives. That's suicide. Yeah, Alice is right. Then someone has to sacrifice himself. Why the hell would he listen to you? How do we know you're not just gonna kill us? Look, I killed Bard because he was a threat to this group. If you want to think that I'm insane, fine. But every action I take is for the greater good of this group. By the way, where is James? Probably outside fighting. I say we do the same. Going out there and fighting them isn't really an option. There were way too many. Uh, let's just go with the Kamikaze plan. What? Does nobody want to blow himself up? I'll do it. It was just a joke. We don't have any more time. I'll do it. What? No. I'll do it for the group. Just go. You don't have to do this. At least I saved the group. It was an honor fighting alongside you. <laughs> I'm sorry, Gregory, but you leave me no choice. You're gonna shoot me? I'm just returning the favor. What do we do with him? We can't just leave him here. Yes, we can. He's just a little piece of dirt who has been in our way for far too long. No, please don't do this. That was before the apocalypse. I'm a different person now. Now it's gonna be really difficult to bring you along, huh? Are you insane? We have to go, right now. You won't be needing those anymore. Thank you. Don't thank me, I was the one who put them on you in the first place. The Kamikaze of Life A few patients just came in. They're not doing really well. There's blood coming out of their eyes. I'll see what I can do. Look! It's... Roxanne. Kill, kill her. Don't look so scared, lads. I'm here to help you. That's not possible. You're supposed to be dead. But did you ever find my body? No. That's because I survived. The cannibal dragged me away and I recovered. I had to ride in a wheelchair, though. I can get all of you out of the wasteland. You just have to follow me. You're kidding, right? 
I get it, you don't trust me, but I quit my job as a phantom, and now I'm as free as a bird. This is a one-time opportunity. Besides, you guys look like you don't have much of a choice. Where do we have to go? The Corinthian Palace, except it's not really a palace anymore. How many people are protecting it? About 20 men. We don't have enough weapons. I know a place where you can get lots of weapons. Just follow me. No, I'm not going. Poor Abraham. Do you really want to stay here and get eaten by zombies? I understand you and I have some issues, but it's your only chance to ever get out of the wasteland. I mean, isn't that what you all want? To get out of the wasteland? Uh, let's go. Nice car you got there, mate. Mind if I borrow it? Look, I don't want any trouble. Who the hell do you think you are? Ugh. Can we take a break? I feel like a zombie. We need to keep moving. They're probably after me. Why? Well, duh. I quit without permission. I was sick of that job. <laughs> Shit. No! No, no, no. My little girl. No. No, no. My little girl. Who's in command here? I am. Well, you've made a very big mistake. What? God, we gotta cut off the arm. Ah! Ah! <coughs> what the hell happened here? Oh my god. The girl is dead. Who are you, if I may ask? I'm Panther, and that's Ajax. The girl was his daughter. Are you with a group or something? Yeah, we have about ten members and we call ourselves the Rangers. By the way, where are you guys going? Oh, we're going to stop the apocalypse. What?! You said you were going to kill the Phantoms and then we would leave this wasteland! Yeah, well I lied. I want to stop the apocalypse. But there is no cure? Oh yes there is. If it works, it's a different question. But I'm sure it will. What makes you think we'll help you? I'm getting sick of you. Why can't you just believe me? But if you want to leave me behind without ending the apocalypse, sure. But you'll never even make it to the water. Whatever. Should I ask my group to come and help? Yeah, we could use the help. Okay, I'm bringing Ajax back to our base and I'll tell them. Cool. Let's move on. I'm sorry, Desmond. I'm sorry I accused you of all those terrible things. I now know they aren't true. It's not your fault. Someone set us both up. Someone had fake evidence. I bet it's the new president who did it. Yeah. What are you doing here, James? Get out! Oh! Everybody, weapons on the ground now! Damn it! You heard me! I'm not stupid. 
Now put your weapons on the ground. I know you from something, but what? Uh, now I remember. You're the son of a bitch with that blue car! Look, man. I didn't want any trouble. You filthy little bugger! There it is. There's what? The arsenal of weapons. Yuppie! Sir, we're ready. Ah, you're awake. What did I miss? Nothing, just focus on your next mission. Everyone, prepare your weapons. We're going on a little trip. What is this place? Well, well, well. You've got to be kidding me. Henrik, you son of a... What the hell are you doing here, Dad? I'm sorry, son, but I did what was necessary. Well, this should be interesting. Is he your father? I didn't know he was with the Phantoms. What do you want, Henrik? That's simple. I want Drake Martini. Drake? Yes. If you give him to me, I can get you out of here. All of you. Drake is dead. What? Are you serious? He was with your group. Bard was supposed to protect him. What did you need him for? That is none of your business. Oh, hello there. Am I too late for the reunion? This just keeps getting more interesting. How the hell are you still alive? Well, I never really died. Mr. Henrik over here has a cure for the zombie virus. However, it can only be used on three people. Dad, why are you doing this? Because the people need a revolution. A revolution I can give them. Are you really the new president? Yes. After what happened to your mother, I couldn't think of anything else than this. The old government killed her. Attack! It's playtime! This bottle has to be protected at all cost. Yes, sir. Should we take it to the tower? Yes.
It's getting really hot here. Does anyone have any explosives? No. Dad, no! Alice, stay here. Why are you doing this? All of this is for her. I'm not okay with this. James, you can still join me. You still can. What? After everything you've done, you want me to... Dynamite now and then leave. You brought dynamite? Yeah, that's the only way we can defeat them. just too confident of ourselves. After we won the battle against the Phantoms, we took the cure and followed Roxanne. Everything went well for three nights. That's when they came. We call them the scientists. They took the cure from us and locked us up. We're being treated like animals here. Hello everyone, my name is Cortez. I am head scientist here and I have a proposition. We give you food and shelter, and in return, you work for us. I'm afraid we're gonna have to decline. We can take care of ourselves. Well, in that case, there are other ways you can be of use to me.
Did you make up your mind? Yes, we've decided to agree with your offer. Are you okay? I'm fine. <coughs> May I ask where you got the zombie cure? We stole it from a group called the Phantoms, but you don't have to worry about them. They're all dead. Tomorrow will be your first mission. I need two samples of the Genesis Serum and an Intipilator. Both of these things you can get at the Corinthian facility 30 miles from here. I need those things because I want to reproduce the serum of the cure so we can stop the apocalypse. Follow my assistant for the weapons. Who the hell are these people? They're not very nice, but at least they have good intentions. Oh, follow me, please. Sweet. to the sun, and therefore, you must be dethroned. That short temper of yours always got in the way. Hola, amigo. Who the hell are you? The name's John. Who are you? I'm Dave. What happened here? Some weird-ass group of survivors came and killed all the phantoms, except me. Ah, that must mean you're with us. Do you know where the cure is? The cure? Oh, that's a beautiful thing. But eh, those weird-ass survivors took it. That's a pity. Would you be interested in joining us? We can use a man like you. Sure, but what are we going to do? We're going to kill those scumbags and retrieve the cure. You all know the objective. Get the Genesis Serum and the Antibulator from the top floor and get back here. Split up in teams of two. So, Abraham, is there still bad blood between us? Depends. What the heck did you do to me back in that lab when you captured me? I was just following orders back then. I injected you with a serum, which gives you the ability to heal at a very fast pace. If the serum worked, we could use it on the phantoms, so no one could stand in their way. The serum was a success, right? I don't know. Hey Tom, what do you think about these new people? Y you mean the scientists? Or the, the group we were with? The group. The Wastelanders. Well, they do get themselves into a lot of trouble. And they almost got everyone of our group killed. Yeah, we should leave them when we get the chance. Although I doubt... Steve, are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine, man. <laughs> Scratch that. So, do you have a name, or do you just go by the assistant? Logan. Logan, huh? I dig it. We just shut up and keep moving? Jeez. I think we've got company. That 
that's it. Hold this for me, will ya? We're getting out of here, boys. Just like old times. Things were a lot simpler back then. Hey, this way! Who did we miss? Only Roxanne and Abraham now. Let's get the hell out of here. Abraham! He's been bitten. Twice. Oh, fuck! We need to get him back to the HQ right now. Your stuff, now. Do you really want this? You heard the man. Give us your fucking stuff. And here I thought we wouldn't have to kill anyone today. This guy. <laughs> this guy. <laughs> To him. He's bitten by a zombie in his neck and his arm. All of this because we had to get that stupid serum of yours. Don't you blame this on me. Give me some morphine and a scalpel. What's happening to his wounds? You can't just operate on him. He's... Uh... He, he's been injected with a serum that allows him to heal at a very fast pace, so the wounds will heal themselves, but he'll still turn if you don't stop the infection. So what do you suppose I do? Give him the cure. No, I can't do that. What do you mean you can't do that? Just give him the damn cure, man. Everyone shut the hell up! I'm trying to save humanity, and if I give him the cure, then I can't save anyone else. There's enough in that bottle. No. There isn't. There has to be something else we can do. He could try to amputate his arm quickly, but he's also been bitten in his neck. We can use a scalpel for that. Sir, his condition is getting worse. We have to operate on him now.
is he? He'll survive. Hey, I'm sorry I yelled at you. I was just worried about Abram. Thanks for saving him. It's all good, man. So, um, are we gonna stay in this place forever? I mean, it is safe, but we're basically prisoners. I'm working on a breakout plan. Any details you can share? Not yet. Abraham, I'm sorry for everything. I should never have experimented on you. And now you're here because of me. I forgive you. <coughs> Cortez, something's wrong. What is it? I think the patient has lost too much blood and is going into shock. May I ask, what are you going to do when you have the cure? I have no intentions of releasing the cure. I have every intention of destroying it. Why? Heinrich told me he'd end the virus after five months. Yeah, well, Heinrich isn't among us anymore. I call the shots now. Isn't the president supposed to call the shots? I am the president. Oh. Kill me. No. What are you doing, Mr. President? I need to see this. Just kill him. No! I need to see him turn! Uh. If anyone's there, we need help. Our car crashed and there's a horde of zombies coming towards us. Save our souls. Get the group ready, Logan. Yes, sir. Get your stuff. We're going on a rescue mission. What? Give us a break, man. Please, we just lost Abraham. Can't... Get your stuff. Stop the car. Excuse me? You son of a bitch. Because of you, Abraham's dead. What do you want from us? Who the heck do you think you are, huh? I don't care about that friend of yours. You just do as you're told, because it's for a good purpose. We're going to save humanity, you idiot. When are you going to see the bigger picture? I can show you them after supper if you want. Sure, honey. Oh my god! Crash! Crash! Amanda! No!
What is happening? The new government has released a virus on the suburbs. Why? I'm not sure, but I think it's because of the gangs and crimes here. I have a safe house down south. That's where we'll be going. Look, that's it. Thank you. Thank you. We got your distress signal. Who are you? I'm Jonathan, and that's Scott. Who are you? We're... Darn it. I see some very well-armed men, and they don't look very friendly. Load your guns. Why? These men are injected with the same serum Abraham was. That means you can't kill them. I have an idea. We can blow this car up and then we rush to our cars and get the heck out of here. Seems like a plan. On my mark. Now! Jonathan! Leave me. Get out of here, Scott. Damn it! Don't worry, Mr. President. I've got a tracker on one of their cars. Ah. <laughs> Excellent work, John. Remind me to give you a bonus when we get back. You're too soft. You need to start acting like a man. Take a look at your brother. don't understand what it's like creating something so beautiful so powerful your greatest accomplishment in life then people try and destroy that Where are we going? What do you want from me? What's your name? I'm Scott. Where are you from? I used to live a little outside of Astro City. Why did those soldiers attack you? I don't know. Jonathan and I were just driving until all of a sudden we drove against a rock and our car flipped. The sound must have been pretty loud because a huge horde of zombies started walking toward us. That's when your people found us and the soldiers attacked us. Would you be willing to work for us? What? You want me to work for you? Have you looked around, man? We're in the middle of a fucking apocalypse. My man saved her damn ass. But you're telling me they should have left you there so you could become zombie dinner? Show some gratitude. Hey, Tom. Wanna play some cards? Sure thing, Philip. Alright boys, here they come.
You open the vaults. Trust me, you don't want to do that. Oh, but I do. Me and my boys here are getting 10 million galaxy credits if we deliver the contents of this vault at a certain location. Just open the damn vault! how you've been avoiding me. Care to tell me why? You're not my sister anymore. You haven't been since the day you left me and dad because mom died. And what did you do afterwards? You created the virus that led to this mad world we live in now. I was foolish back then. I was going through some tough times and I needed some money. All of a sudden, this guy showed up at my house and promised me 20 million galaxy credits if I created a virus. All this just for a little money? I'm sorry. I didn't think of the consequences. Yeah, sorry doesn't help. Follow me. Quick. What's going on? I have a plan to get us all out of here. I don't think he's gonna be of any use to us. Should I take him downstairs to the lab? Yes might have purpose there. Oh, and Logan, could you do something else for me? zombie is our test subject. If this works, we can end the apocalypse. You've got to be kidding me. It worked. Logan, we can end the apocalypse. <laughs> you actually did it. I brought all of you here because I have a plan to get us out of this place. About damn time. I'm sorry, but I don't think that's such a good idea. I mean, this place is like a fortress, and it's a hell of a lot safer than the wasteland. Yeah, I'm with Panth on this one. Are you kidding me? We're prisoners here. Yeah, we can't stay here any longer. We'll never make it out there alive! You of all people should understand that, Gregory! You haven't even heard his plan, for God's sake. Hey, come on, man. No need to involve our lord and savior. Everyone, just shut up! Search for any survivors! Be remembered. If it 
weren't for you, we wouldn't be able to stop the apocalypse. Steve, where are you? Steve! Ah, good to see you. Thank God you're still alive. Destroy them! Everyone, we need to go now. where I can see him. many secrets. Hallelujah. Everyone grab a gun. 
We're gonna need all the firepower we can get. Cortez, how do you want to kill these soldiers? With our healing factor, guns won't be enough. That's why I'm gonna look for some explosives. But cutting off their head will also do the trick. RPG. Crap. David? Panther, how the mighty have fallen. What are you doing? Simply letting nature reign free. You need to stop getting in its way. You don't deserve the cure. No one does! You have no idea how hard I've worked to make the perfect virus. I will not let you destroy my life's work. Finally. What are we gonna do now? Oh 
Adios, amigos. Logan, you okay? Couple scratches and bruises, but nothing too serious. I'm so sorry. It's not your fault. I wasn't there for her when she needed me. I'm a terrible person. And don't say I'm not because you and I both know I am. We can make some sort of a funeral for her. So, what now? We stay together. We survive. I know a place. Not too far from here. It's called Diamond City. Everyone's welcome there. Sounds good to me.